So hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, hope you're all well. Today we are fishing the River Tyne. Um, had a bit of spare time so I thought I'd get myself out down here for a little bit. The tide is going out now. But I'm going to fish it for about 2 or 3 hours to the low. I think it's about 0 0.9. Um, baits we're using today is peter crabs, mackerel. Um, we're going to target flatties today. We're going to flatty bashing down the River Tyne in heaven. No wind at all, um, complete current, the gust about six, it's complete, no wind at all. But um, it's been a bit rainy, but got this jacket on, I'll be alright. And um, yeah, thought I'd come in here for a couple of hours, see if I can catch some fish with the channel people. I haven't done a video in about a week and a half, two weeks nearly. Um, so I thought I'd get myself out, try and catch some fish with the camera, and just enjoy myself really, yeah, and get fishing again. So um, yeah, let's get set up people. Using the Ziplec rod and the Sonic reel for 10,000. Get that fastened on like that. Some crab bodies on, see if we can hoop it a flatty. Today I'm just going to use a standard pulley rig, you know, um, two wheel hoop on, I'm going to use crab bodies um, and a bit of mat on, see if we can get any flatties. I'm just going to use a standard six ounce lead, not much pull on the tide so I think it'll be fine. Little bit of frozen crab I've had in the freezer. I've noticed a flatties, just half of one of them on a small hook, and that's normally that does the job. Normally a one or two size hook because the mouths aren't that big. So, like, one of them will do. Free like that. What I normally do is just put on like that, hold it, and bind it on with some thread. Like that, a couple more winds, make sure it's nice and secure. And there you go, that should do. A little dink over the edge, really. 34. <coughs> and there we have it. First cast is off. It's a bit of a pull to the water, but if it gets too much, I'll just put a grip around it. Yeah, we've got our first crab body on now, about 30 foot out. Now it's a waiting game. Well, it's been in for two minutes and already I almost had a few little knocks. For being a drizzly day, it's pretty warm, like. Pretty warm down here. Feels really warm. Only reason I'm wearing this because it's. I thought, I thought it uh, might drizzle a bit, so I'll keep myself dry. Tiny bit drizzling, but it's alright. So I'm hoping get a few flatties. Get a few flatties on the camera, you know. And just while I'm here, I want to say thank you to every single one of you who subscribed to my channel. Um, I think it's about 670 years right now. It's amazing. I'm absolutely buzzing, you know. The sport's really good. You know, the comments, the likes, everything. I appreciate every single one of you, so thank you very much, people. Thank you. It comes back. I saw Bob up and down, just had bites.
<clears throat> Hoping you can see the top of that tip rod all right up there. Little bites there, I was loving it. Definitely flatty bites. There, there, there you go again, it's going. Got bites. Get in there. Get up there. My first flatty for the session people. And lovely crab bodies, best bait around. There you go again, there you go, it goes again. Little knocks it. Let's go on board. Thing is with these flatties though, they normally swallow the hook right down. But you don't know what, if you should strike early and miss it or let it swallow it down. So I normally just leave it. And eventually it'll swallow it down and it'll definitely get hooked. I've also heard there's a few eels kicking about as well. There's a few eels kicking about the road town, so you know, possibly catching an eel here. Loud that plane. Oh. Yeah, good sign so far. First cast bite. That's what I wanted. That's what we came for. Nope, nothing on this one. You'd have to shred it all off. Absolutely shredded that crab. There's a lot of weed as well. A lot of weed. Yeah, look, been absolutely shredded that. Let's put fresh bait on. And I'm going to put a grip on as well. Put a grip on because it's a bit pulley that tight. Rapidly go there. Just going to change weights. Change to a gripper. The tide's really pulling. Similar as that, there you go. Chopping them in half. There you go, perfect.
있고 We're gonna try crab and mackerel. Let's get a whip down. I've just seen a massive salmon over there in the water, jumping out, swimming up the river town. A huge silver salmon, just jumping out. Absolutely massive, must have been about a big one, about £10 or something, it looked absolutely whopper. Just seen it jumping out on its side and you can see the side of its belly. Absolutely massive that. Don't know if you've seen it on camera, but it's absolutely huge. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hope it's all well. It's day two. We're down the heaven ten, fishing with flat easy and crab baits. Let's get casted off. As you know in the previous um <clears throat> the start of this video we came here yesterday um, didn't catch anything so i've come back today to try and catch a fish basically and um see if i can get a flat on the channel people because um you know it's july now it's prime time of flight he's down here in the river time especially the summer time um so yeah let's get the other rod set up brought a little tiny brought me a little spinning rod and a little tiny little spool just for a laugh you know so i've got two rods out um, so I'm just going to whack that out and then see if I can catch with that as well so yeah we'll set that one up and we'll get that one out and um, yeah I'll come back for catch these fish people so fingers crossed we'll get a fish today for the channel people
as the rods off to be a little bit more windy today it was yesterday. I think it's only it's about 15 mile an hour gusts, so but it feels a lot windy than that. But yeah, I've got the baits out now. Got a big rod, small rod, got brought a spin rod for a laugh, you know. <clears throat> so I can get an extra bait out. But you never know. A number of years ago that's where my friend Jamie started from, at Hembury along there. Like 14 year old kids, you know. Probably younger than that. Fishing up the head marina, using my dinner money for ragworm and fishing with telescopic rods. That's how we started. You know, that's how we started ever fishing hobby, you know what I mean? I'm still fishing there 20 years later, so yeah, it's all good. And hopefully, we'll get some fish on these rods, people. So, yeah, stay tuned and hopefully, we'll get a fish on the channel. That'll be nice. I've only got bites in that little rod, haven't I? Got bites in that little tiny rod. Definitely got bites. There we go. Can you see? That little rod's got mental. Twinges on the um, the big rod as well as it left. Oh, 
it in your line and get your lines all tangled. First cast look and eel. There's the first fish. Oh, it's wrapping over me like that. Let's get it un unhooked and put it back. So there we go, first cast. First fish, an eel. Here we go. A little bit of peanut crab, we'll get it out and see if we can get ourselves another fish. Again on the small spinning rod. To be honest, I think it's, I might have been about eel. <coughs> I mean, there's a few eels kicking about the road time recently, like, so <coughs> I hope it's not a session of eels. Well, yeah, the fish is a fish, especially on black the last few sessions, so you know, I'm not going to complain. Yeah. 
number two. That's what I'm doing, I'm trying one short cast, one long cast, just to see where the fish are feeding from. Yeah, we've got peanut crabs, and so far two eels on the little rod. Um, been here for about two hours now, tide's coming in, probably fish here for another couple hours, and then head off, but um, yeah, not bad, you know, two eels so far, can't complain, but hopefully we'll try and get a flatty, you know. Try and get myself a flatty there, and that'll be nice. Um, so yeah, let's wait and see. And also, I'd like to say, yeah, I say a little lot, but I mean, uh, thank you to all my subscribers. You know, I think I'm on 675 or six now. I'm only a few hundred away from monetizing this channel. Know, so if you're new to this channel please get down there and subscribe hit that big red button and um, that'd be great help me on my way to monetize my channel that is my goal so if you can make that happen that's um, that's just amazing because you know without you I wouldn't have this channel without the views without the subscribers this wouldn't happen so thank you every single one of you who do subscribe and um, support the channel it means a lot thank you Crap. That was all along. 
big dirty doggy. <coughs> so there it is, big dirty doggy. Chuck it back in. Two eels, it's better than nothing. Um, so I'm happy with that, you know, didn't blank or two eels. Seems to be a lot down here of other YouTube channels what have been catching a lot of eels down here as well. At the time, so yeah, feels a lot eely. Was hoping for a flat, he didn't get one. But we'll always try again next time. But um, I'm happy with the two eels, you know what I mean? So yeah, thank you for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, like and subscribe everyone, that'd be great. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. God bless.